Harness the power of pauses. Master silence in public speaking. Hello, everyone. Today, we're going to tackle a fascinating aspect of public speaking, using pauses and silence effectively. Yes, that's right. The power of silence can be as compelling as your words. So, buckle up as we take a deep dive into the world of vocal variety and tone. We often underestimate the power of a well-placed pause. It's not just empty space, it's a powerful tool that allows your message to resonate. Pauses provide your audience with an opportunity to absorb and process what you've just said, and when used effectively, they can create dramatic, powerful moments in your speech. There are several types of pauses you can use in your speech. Short pauses are just a brief moment of silence used to separate thoughts or ideas. Medium pauses are a bit longer and used to emphasize the importance of a particular point. And then we have long pauses. These are used sparingly but can be very impactful, allowing your audience to ponder on a significant point or creating suspense. Incorporating pauses effectively requires practice and intuition. Here are some strategies you can adopt. Emphasize key points. After delivering a critical point or idea, pause briefly. This creates a moment for your audience to reflect on what you've said. Create suspense. Longer pauses can create anticipation and hold your audience's attention. Replace fillers. Instead of using verbal fillers like um, like, or, you know, use a pause. It makes you appear more thoughtful and composed. Here are some exercises you can do to improve your pause technique. Read aloud. Pick a text and practice reading it aloud, adding pauses at different places. Record and review. Record your speeches or presentations and note where a pause could have improved clarity or impact. Improvise. Use a random topic and start speaking about it. Incorporate pauses intentionally to see their effect. And that wraps up our discussion on the effective use of pauses and silence in public speaking. It might seem counterintuitive, but silence, my friends, can indeed be golden. I hope you found this information valuable. Keep practicing, stay confident, and remember, your best tool in public speaking is you. Your voice, your words, and yes, your silence. Happy speaking, everyone!